Hey guys, it's CJ from AirDog. We're here with you today for an exciting new product release. Today we're gonna to be showcasing our Diesel RX water and fuel sensor kit. This is gonna be applicable for an 07.5 to 2023 Dodge um, that already has our fuel system installed on that vehicle. Included in the kit is gonna be a new water separator, the sensor itself, the harness needed for installation, some zip ties to clean up that harness installation, as well as full product instructions. So there's a brief overview of this Diesel RX water and fuel sensor kit. Um, now that we got you guys up to speed, we're gonna get in the back, get the truck on the lift and show you how to install it. Now that we got the truck up in the air here, off camera, we changed the fuel filter form, so we already clamped these lines off. You guys are going to clamp all three lines to your air dog, just so you don't get excessive fuel all over you. But we're going to go ahead and get this water separator changed out. Um, again, we do include a fresh water separator in this kit. Get our new water separator installed. You don't have to tighten these excessively tight, just like an oil filter, guys. Just get it nice and snug. And then we're going to go ahead and remove this pit cock. So we'll get this pulled out of there. Get a 15 16 wrench and your sensor. Go ahead and thread the sensor directly in the bottom of this water separator. This is gonna be an O-ring seal. And again, this is plastic, so no need to get super aggressive with it, but go ahead and get this snugged up. And now all we need to do is run the harness. Alrighty, since we got this sensor pre-installed and the truck's already on the lift, we're gonna go ahead and do the underside of the truck wiring real quick. Uh, so we're gonna connect the harness to the water separator sensor. Um, so we're going to also zip tie it. I like to go to the cradle bracket here just to tie this wire up nice and tight. So we're gonna get this zip tied. Since this already obviously does have an air dog, um, we'll be able to zip tie it to the pre-existing wiring harness as well as the fuel lines headed up to the engine bay. So we'll go ahead and get this tidied up and get back with you in the engine bay. The next step is we're gonna to need to unplug the factory wiring from the factory water and fuel sensor. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and get you guys in here, um, get this unplugged, and this will plug in to the factory side, and then we'll get it zip tied up. So just to show you guys on your fortunes what you'll be seeing on your dash, we went ahead and got the truck up in the air, it's running. Uh, we're gonna dip the sensor directly into water just to show you what that message will look like. Um, there's really no water going through the system, but we're just dipping that in there just so you guys can see that it retains that factory light. As you guys just saw there, um, it went ahead and signaled on the dash that there was water in the fuel. That's when you would know you need to drain your water separator. Um, this particular truck, it popped up a large message as well as that small little icon that's letting you know there's water in your fuel. Um, so again, it'll notify you right on your factory cluster. If you were to ever be driving on the road and get alerted with that message, um, you obviously need to immediately pull off, go ahead and drain that filter, um, and then get you to your closest, safest place. And then it'd be a good idea just to go ahead and service that filter, um, just to be safe as it obviously had a large amount of water in it. Alrighty guys, as you see, this water and fuel sensor kit integrates very well directly into your factory trucks wiring. Um, this is gonna again be applicable for your 07.5 to 2023 Dodges, so it hits a large year range for you there. This is currently available for purchase on our website or through your preferred AirDog dealer. Um, so if this fits your needs, go ahead and get one coming and also keep an eye out. We do plan to extend this product line uh, to have water fuel sensors for other models in the future.